answers the piece of question. And this, and here we lie. Here what lies the problem with America and the over consumer over consumption of art. It's the idea that the idea that you know that people people will claim people people love to have artists on their bookshelves. They love to have artists in their CD players, um, their DVD players. When they, they they like it, but the idea of having to actually live with art or an artist is a very uncomfortable thing for a lot of people. And I think in this case, that's just simply what you have. You have a case here of like, you know, people saying that they want art or people being open to the concept of art, but then failing to recognize that you, one, you have the intent of the artist, but then you also have the interpretation of those who are viewing it. And it can be a wide range of interpretations of it. But I think in this society, most people want to be able to control the art that they consume not only just consume as far as, you know, like I said, and from the stores, but even what they consume with their eyes. But hey, you know, art hurts. That's why I call my company Art Hurts. Because if you ain't offending nobody or shaking things up a little bit, you ain't making art. Everybody is supposed to like it. Everything ain't for everybody. I don't, I prefer Ritz over saltines. So am I, am I crazy for wanting Ritz over saltines?